Bradley Walsh has been a huge hit with viewers over the years, especially after his cheeky charm on ITV hit the chase. It seems his popularity hasn't gone unnoticed by TV bosses, especially after Philip Schofield was accused of skipping the queue to see Queen Elizabeth II lying in state. This morning hosts Philip and Holly Willoughby recently felt the wrath of the general public, who claimed the duo jumped the queue to see the Queen at Westminster Hall. When speaking up about the incident, the hosts insisted that they visited Westminster as part of the media, and would never jump the queue. Since then, Philip has lost his £1 million deal to advertise We Buy Any Car. However, the company claimed that his five-year contract was due to end in 2022, a decision taken prior to stories about him. A source reportedly told The Mirror, as Philip's popularity wanes, television and advertising execs are looking at Bradley Walsh. He's squeaky clean, popular with viewers and doesn't have any of the baggage that Philip has. PR expert Mark Borkowski has claimed Bradley's range makes him a powerful force, adding, he's got a nose for what the ITV viewing public wants, and also has managed to avoid all the negativity that dogs Philip Schofield. Anything he touches at the moment is gold. I've always said the Holly and Phil Cugate would ultimately be judged whether or not advertisers felt they were negative. For a commercial TV station, if your public has an issue and advertisers have an issue then there is a quick exit stage right. Bradley is good friends with Holly and Phil, especially after working with the latter on the game show Takeoff with Bradley Holly. When the images of Holly and Phil were first revealed, Many flocked to slam the pair on social media, with one going as far as to create a poll to get them kicked from presenting this morning.